The eSASTUR Group has been creating infrastructures for companies from diverse industrial sectors since 1978, especially high-voltage substations. In times of change, those with an open mind to learning will seize the future. At eSASTUR, we generate useful training tools to improve our productive processes. We innovate to grow in terms of quality, efficiency and safety. The eSASTUR Group has designed a practical and intuitive virtual simulator for the training and assessment of electrical substation workers. The simulation scenario is a 132 kV single bus substation with two lines and a transformer. The instructor accesses the substation configuration by means of a password. The application warns the user that access to areas with electrical hazards is restricted to authorized workers or to personnel supervised by such workers. The simulator allows workers to move around the work area, receive training and retraining in risk prevention measures by means of an ongoing learning process that will lead them to improve their working conditions and to avoid possible accidents in the workplace. The Spanish Royal Decree 614-2001 defines the figures of authorized and qualified workers, as well as the attributions each has regarding low and high voltage work, professional experience and specialized knowledge. This Royal Decree also specifies safety distances as a function of the voltage, of weather conditions and of the degree of control and demarcation of the work area. During the simulation, the worker must recognize and use the appropriate work equipment and personal protection equipment, inactinic visors, insulating gloves, insulating stools or mats, fireproof clothing and work equipment, such as poles, grounding elements, etc. Although personal protective equipment is the final barrier protecting the worker, there are a series of preventive measures to avoid electrical accidents that are based on the principle of working in the absence of voltage. The Spanish Royal Decree 614-2001 provides us with five golden rules. The first golden rule, disconnect open circuits. The worker must insulate the part of the installation where work is to be carried out from all power supplies. The second golden rule, lockout. The worker must ensure the installation against any possible reconnection, preferably via mechanical lockout. The third golden rule, verify the absence of voltage. The worker must also verify the absence of voltage in all the live parts in the installation in the work area and ensure that the devices that verify said absence work correctly. The fourth golden rule, short circuit to ground. The part of the installation where work is being carried out must be short circuited to ground at both ends and said grounding must be visible from the work area. The fifth golden rule, protect and signpost. Finally, the worker must demarcate the work area and protect it from any live parts in the vicinity, identifying said area by placing barriers or other signs. Reconnecting the power supply. In general, the sequence to re-establish the power supply is the inverse of that required to carry out disconnection, and the safety measures are also the same in each of the steps. The ESASTUR Group's Virtual High Voltage Substation is a tool based on new technologies that provides continuous training and assessment in order to continue growing. Learning to conquer the future www.grupoisastor.com